Hi, this is Mr. C from Dividend. In this video, we're going to cover number three of eight of the Divi Person module, how to import it. This one's the full width one. Uh, we're going to import a single module. We're going to add some styles and we're going to change colors. Uh, so let's get started. Before I forget, if this is the first video you're watching, please go back uh, and watch the video number one in the series. That video is uh, 18 minutes. Uh, I cover a bunch of different things which you may find helpful. Okay, so let's get started. First, you want to navigate to the zip file and we're looking for number three of eight, uh, the JSON file. So that I've already unzipped over here. Then you want to go to your website uh, where you want to install this module. You want to go to Divi. You want to go to Divi, to the Divi library. And then uh, we've got some layouts over here. I'm just going to trash those guys. Uh, so we want to import. Then we want to click on the import button again. We want to choose the file. We want to import the JSON file because this has got everything already inside of it. This is a really fast way to do it. You wait for the check mark, wait for it to reload again, and then we should have everything there. In this case, we only have two, so let's go with uh, the three of eight. Um, we want to add this to a page that would be the next step so let's go to pages let's go add new page in this case we're going to go three of eight you want to click use the divi builder you want to pick the right template depending on how your theme is set up then we're going to go from the modules click add to library we're going to pick three of eight there we go, and they're in. So let's publish, then we can go and take a look. Right click, open new tab, and there they are. Now you'll notice there's, obviously it doesn't look that great. And the reason for that is because we haven't added CSS styles yet, which is in one of the other files, uh, all came together with your Divi product. Then we also need to adjust the gutter in order to get the full width. So first let's go and find the styles. And for that, we want to go to the zip files and open the cascading style sheet for number three of eight. So we open that in our favorite editor. We go control A, control copy, or control C. Then we go to Divi, Theme Options, and we scroll all the way to the bottom and Custom CSS, Paste. That's the style we want there. Click Save. Now, if we go back to this page and we reload, we, our animations should be there. That's great. So we've made some good progress. Now, the only thing we need to do is change the gutter width. And for that, you go back to this page. I'm just going to reload it to be safe. And then you want to go to this little menu over here. Click that and scroll. The gutter width should be 1. And very simply you save. Click the update button. Then you can come back and reload the page. Ta-da! There we go. So the next one is if you want to change the styles, you can go into uh, the particular person module. You can then adjust the, the text color, dark or light. You can adjust advanced settings over here, change the colors, icon colors, etc. Uh, update body text color. You can save this as a new global so that the styles can transfer to the rest of the items if that's what you want to do. I think in this instance, uh, if you have a look at the sample page that we've got here, um, these are, I, I probably wouldn't save these as globals. I would change these individually for each one of them. 
Now, if you change something on the modules here uh, in, the, in the advanced design settings and something doesn't update the way that you expect it to, most likely you need to go and look in the CSS file and update those colors. So you would switch either, um, you can look in your text editor or you could go to the theme options make this a little bit bigger for the, and the custom styles and then just search for that color that you want to change and then update the color here and then save and you should be good to go that wraps up this video thanks for watching